Hello, 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 and welcome back guys and girls to some more Mario Kart 8 on the Nintendo Wii U. So what you do know if you have been staying tuned recently, we have actually tried out all the new courses, all the new Grand Prix this game does have to offer. So for now, we're actually going to dive into the 200cc mode and test out a few of the other um, courses which were originally packaged in this game. So we'll go 200cc as I said before. It is very tough, I must admit. And then again, we have done it in new courses which you didn't really have any, any, any experience with. So today we're going to go with Isabel, we've done it already but we will actually use her new vehicle which is the City Tripper, we'll go Retro Off-Road Wheels and then the Paper Animal Crossing Glider to finish off the match. So we'll probably start with the Mushroom Cup, we just start from the very beginning, unless we should do something, okay I guess we'll go Mushroom Cup, it's probably the quickest one out of them all and uh, this should be fun, so I'm obviously more familiar with these levels so we'll see actually how it does compare to some of the new ones, so we do have more experience here and uh, hopefully it does I mean, it's going to make a slight difference because obviously you're going a lot quicker. You have to time your turns um, probably a bit before than what you would usually do with 150cc and all that. So I'll see how it plays now. I did say I was going to show you guys and see how it's going to go for us. I was actually going to do this online until I found out. I don't think you can do 200cc online. Well, there was no option for it. There may actually be a way, but I couldn't find an option anywhere. So I decided to just play it alone by myself. Holly's not here today, so we can't do any multiplayer. But if you guys do want to see some multiplayer split screen, then we'll definitely bring that your way. But we'll see how this goes. So this is uh, Mario Circuit. The first course I've actually played in this game is very is very basic, so I don't think we're going to have too much trouble with uh, 200cc on this course. Main main thing is it's, it's quite an open course. It's like There's a lot of room to maneuver, so I don't think we're going to see ourselves flying off the course or anything like that. The only probably tough section may just be this... Uh, corner we're coming up to now, which is just here. This may be the only tough part. It didn't really seem too tough yet. It should be a breeze, seriously. It should be a breeze. Hopefully we can get first place here. We, we're we're going to go for gold. It does actually reset all your uh, trophies and all your progress when doing when doing 200cc. So if you are a completionist, then you have to go through this all again and uh, get those triple stars, which are very tough to get, especially in some of the later levels where there's like a lot of turns to handle. It can be very tough. But we're in a good position at the moment. First place. We've got a horn in hand and there's no one close to us at all. This is kind of weird. So there's definitely a lot more. I know this is quite an easy course. But it definitely does feel a lot more easier. Because I'm more, I'm more familiar with the course. Uh, we know where we're going. And plus it is, it is a wide open road. So I won't make any judgments with this level yet. But so far, so good. But yeah, definitely one of my most favourite um, Nintendo games. I've, oh god, the horn, horn. Phew, I almost thought we had the horn for a second. Okay, that worked perfectly. If you guys don't know, the horn can actually... Uh, protect you from any weapon in this game. I've never actually seen a horn against a horn. So if you if you, if you can use a horn as an offensive weapon, it kind of just like makes them spin out or something. I've never actually seen a horn against a horn. So it'll be pretty interesting to see. And a mushroom in first place. Wow, that was new. Was that a part of the update or something? Because I've never actually had a mushroom in first place before. That must be a one-off. But we do start things off on a good note. 15 points, top of the table. Isabel is doing her thing. And I'm not really a fan of uh, motorcycles in this game. Well, this does feel a lot more natural. Uh, this is the new vehicle for Isabel specifically, and it feels good. It's the little scooter. I went for the wheels, which doesn't give it too much speed. It gives us a decent amount of speed and a lot of grip, because you're going to need a lot of grip in 200cc. So off next is the water park, the mushroom cup, 200cc. Let's see how this goes. So this is from um, Super Mario Sunshine, I think it is. I believe so anyway. And uh, this should be fun. Oh yes, it definitely is. This is from the... There's actually like a world based on this uh, map where you fight against like Metal Bowser or something like that. It's a lot of fun. Only if we could have a remake of Mario Sunshine on the Wii U, that would be absolutely amazing because, I mean, some people love it, some people hate it. Personally, I love Super Mario Sunshine. It's actually my second favorite uh, Mario game of all time. With Super Mario 64, 64 being the first one, pretty much like the first one I actually like got sucked into. I played that at a very young age and it was like the best experience ever. Definitely like my top three games of all time. And not the best lap, I mean it was a decent lap, but we should take first place here with this red shell if he doesn't block it. Oh shoot, that was a big jump there. Even like all the, like, with 200cc it opens up a lot of new shortcuts for you. I can't really demonstrate any in this map right now. But for example, with the glider it does give you like a bit more distance, so you can like cut through extra bits of grass and stuff like that. So I mean like the shortcuts are all visible in the map, they're not like hidden anywhere. But uh, it's up to you if you want to cut through or not, but it can be very, very handy in 200cc. I've never actually personally tried it myself, but I did see a lot of videos on it. Oh god, that was a close one. Wait, is that Red Shell? Oh no, why did you have to come at this time? At least it stops just in front of these, or just for these weapons. Never mind, we actually got the boomerang in hand. But we're off to a decent start. I'm going to try and get first place in every race here. 
uh, that's gonna be my main goal, get the gold star. Cause I'm gonna try and 100% complete this game. I'm quite way behind. I've had this since day one. I still haven't actually unlocked all the characters yet. But uh, I'm not. I'm not far. I think we need three more. And then again, we do have three new, three new characters. In a way, there's four because you got the villager. You can go female or male. You've got. Oh shoot! Why did you overtake me? Please. Oh my god! He's got mushroom as well. Oh, are you kidding me? Bowser, why'd you do that? Just when I said I wanted to get the three golden stars, I was in high hopes and my dreams have been crushed by Bowser. Thanks a lot. We tied on points, 27 each. Not too bad, I guess. I guess we just go for the gold trophy because we still haven't got gold in 200cc. So that's kind of our main goal here. It's our main priority. And uh, so far, not too bad. So up next, we do have hopefully something a bit more competitive. And we have Sweet, Sweet Canyon. Oh yes, this this level always makes me hungry. So let's see, we've got donuts here, we've got the wafers, we've got gingerbread men, and we also have Yoshi's cheering us on, pink Yoshi's. It's not every day you see that, and let's see how this goes. Third place, wait, third place? Wait, did we just come third there? I'm pretty sure we just came second, what the? It usually starts you where you last finish, so maybe we did come third, that, that's kind of weird. I thought we, I was pretty certain we came second, but never mind, we're tied first. Wait, why don't you see the green shell in midair? I don't know. Never mind. Alright, I'm coming for you, Bowser. Oh, yes. The music in this level is so... Uh, so relaxing. Literally every song in this game is beautiful. One one personal favourite of mine is uh, from one of the new levels. The, what's it called now? It's the new like, F-Zero level. I forgot what it's called, but it's a really awesome uh, soundtrack to that, to that level. It does make things a lot more intense when, when racing with your friends. Alright, but yeah, with online, I did mention earlier, I do think there's an option of 200cc. You can actually play over new levels online, which is to be expected. I just don't know about 200cc. We've got a red shell here. We're going to save this. We're going to pass you Link. We're going to pass you Bowser. And we're going to save this for whoever's in front. By judging on the map, I think it could be... Wait, wait. Oh, no. Why did we look on the map? That really did affect us there. Alright, never mind. We still got another lap after this, but I guess we'll just get rid of this red shell before we get to the next set of weapons. And uh, see what we can do from here. Damn, we really need a mushroom there. We got stuck in the in the chocolate mud. They kind of just want to cut through everything. But we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Third place. Green shell's going crazy. It did get us the hit. Shy guy. See you later, sucker. Another green shell. Damn, it's not really giving us anything special in this course. Okay, we'll block that. Oh, so it was actually... Wait, who was that we just overtook? It actually... By first glance, it looked like Birdo. But it definitely wasn't because she's not in this game. Wait, why isn't she in this game? I used to love her in Double Dash. Along with Diddy Kong and everyone like that. Oh, that was crazy. I really wish they'd come back. And another bad finish. Are you kidding me? Right again, we get overtaken again. And we have to settle for third. Second, okay, second. Toadette, why? She's like my favourite character in this game. Why are you doing this to me? 39 points, at least we are first now. We're not joint first anymore. Bowser training by the four points. Shy Guy training by seven in third place. It was Wendy, it must have been Wendy. Okay, she does have that kind of like Birdo feel to her. But yes, moving on to the final course. Hopefully we can get that gold trophy. These these Grand Prix are a lot quicker now. Of course, things are faster. But it almost like cuts off a third of the time it usually takes to get them done. I think I passed a few of them in like... 11 minutes when it usually takes me like 17 altogether so in that aspect I do actually prefer that getting through these a lot quicker but I still need a few more trophies to get in 150cc even mirror mode I still haven't completed mirror mode at all I'm not even half done all right get out of the way Wendy all right Shiger you've got the lead here but it's not gonna last long I promise you what did I tell you all right I'm gonna aimlessly throw it behind probably should have looked but yeah, I thought I may as well just try... Oh shoot, that usually only opens on the second lap or something. But yeah, I thought I may as well just try some of the older levels to see how we fare in 200cc. This, these ones feel fairly easy. As I said before, it's kind of, you get like a wide... Um, oh god. You get like a wide area to maneuver around. So there's not really too much room for mistakes. I mean, there's like plenty of room for mistakes, I was supposed to say. So we're pretty much safe here. I did try Moo Moo Meadows, which is really awesome in uh, 200 cc. So same with a uh, Baby Park. You're gonna have a lot of fun with that one. It's probably one of my favorites in uh, 200 cc so far. It's kind of funny because 
Actually, I was, I've always been a fan of Baby Park, especially from the GameCube. Uh, actually, that's the only game I was introduced on. But it's always been like a personal favorite of mine, even to this day. I don't know, it's just something about it. Because like with, with Double Dash, you get so many different weapons. I can't remember, I remember you had like the Yoshi eggs, uh, which were... Because like each character had their own like finishing moves. Yoshi's was the Yoshi egg, of course. And like all these items used to get like scattered all over the map. It just made things so crazy within each lap. And with the cool thing about that level, it's got like seven laps in total. And like each lap is... Even though it's the same course each lap, each lap felt different because there's like always a new obstacle in the way. It was always a lot of fun. And uh, with 200cc, I just think it makes it even more spectacular. But yes, we need the first place here. I don't think we need it, but I would love to get first place. Bowser in front. He's our main rival at the moment, so we'll take him out with that red shell. And uh, as, as long as we finish in front, in front of him, we should be safe. And we probably do need a top three finish as well. And I think we are good. There we go. Isabel cruising through the finish line. Oh, I wanted to glide through, but never mind. 200cc. In a way, it didn't really feel as fast as I, as, as I hoped, just for this court, just for this Grand Prix, mainly because I found it quite comfortable. In some of the levels with like a lot of turns and stuff, it's very, very difficult. Stuff like Rainbow Road, Baby Park, uh, every pretty much every course from the new DLC, I find them all super difficult in 200cc. It's a lot more easier and it feels a lot more natural with some of the earlier levels. But when, once you go to some of the levels towards the end, you're gonna have a tough time, guys. Seriously, it does take a lot of practice. It's a lot of fun, and I uh, can't wait to play a lot more. So we'll be bringing a lot more Mario Kart to the channel. I thought I'd use this one as a kind of like to make up for some of the previous episodes because we did fail in uh, capturing that golden trophy. Thankfully, we have got it here. We didn't get the triple star. We wanted it. We only got the one star. We did get a new character. That was my aim to get all the characters. I wonder who this is going to be. It's probably going to be. It's probably not even exciting news for you guys because by now you probably have all the characters yourself. But to me, it's pretty exciting. So we'll see who we get, and it's going to be. Metal Mario, yes, definitely one I actually wanted from the start. So it's gonna be pretty fun. And it's actually cool because he's got like his own themed scooter as well. Wait, is this is this the Isabel scooter? Yeah, it's the City Tripper, so it's, it's even got like his own theme to it, which is really awesome. But yeah, that's gonna be all for now, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy this video. If you want to see more, then let me know down in the comments below. Be sure to give it a thumbs up as it really does help. And if you want to see any multiplayer split screen or any online play or anything like that, let me know down below also. And until then, guys, have a great day. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. See ya.